What do we want? Fair play for supply staff. When do we want it? Now. Supply teachers and support staff were underpaid by about £40 to £100 a day. People think that we are paid more than teachers. We're not. We're, paid, we're massively underpaid. We are giving rubbish work when we go into schools. We're undervalued and we are overworked as well. And we've had enough. So this protest today is to highlight that it's agencies that are making money. It's agencies that are taking money from schools and our students. We have some very good qualified supply teachers. We need them in the classrooms. At the moment, supply support staff are being made to do teaching jobs where they shouldn't be. And they're not paid to scale for that either. Something that we've been working on within the union is trying to get school registers. So trying to get um, supply staff back in-house, back within schools, back in local authority control, pay to scale and actually go in and working through training programmes with schools and working with teachers and support staff within schools. This is really important that we are outside the offices of teaching personnel. Teaching personnel, if we are being honest, what they are is corporate exploiters who should have no place in education. Shame, what, shame on them. They make over £100 million in annual turnover over £30 million in profit. They are registered uh, for tax purposes in Luxembourg. It is abhorrent that they are extracting wealth from our schools, our colleges and our communities, taking resource directly from the mouths of children, also out of the pockets of hardworking supply teachers and supply staff. There is a huge difference between what this lot charge a school and what ends up in the pocket of supply staff. We need to be taking on this agency and every other agency, but also be resisting that broad approach that we're seeing in education. Rampant privatisation everywhere. It's about time we had education back as a public good, operating in the interests of our children, not in the interests of CEOs and shareholders. So let's keep on turning up and let's keep on fighting. Stop the rip-off agencies! Stop the rip-off agencies! Stop the